Hi moms, welcome to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Diana. I'm a mom of one. She just turned one, so it's been a journey and a half. And today I thought about doing something that I'm curious myself. So yeah, so it's I really, really want to deeply review this small fix diaper because everyone talks about how great it is. And then I've done my own research. I've gone to reviews on Facebook, reviews on the internet, and some of them are not so good. Um, the most interesting negative, okay, before I get into the negative and the positive reviews. So, yeah, I, honestly, like, in, in all ignorance, I used to think Malfi was like a Kenyan product, but it's not. So, Malfi started a long time ago in Turkey. Guys, like, this is an old product. And yet we didn't even, or maybe other moms knew about it and I didn't. But yeah, it just, it was introduced to the African market just recently, starting with Nigeria. It's very, very big in Nigeria. Yeah, so I've done a little bit of research on it, uh, when it started, where it started, why it's so popular, and what made it so popular was their commercials. And even the Kenyan commercial is quite interesting, yeah. So I, I, oh, in my head, like as a new mom, I just know about pampas and huggies. Yeah, but it's always good to just try other things and see like what is it, why are people so amazed by this other product? And you could be missing out on something that's very good and you don't want to try it out. So, so I'll start positive. Um, okay, so I'll start positive and then I'll finish up with the negative. So the positive, so it, as you can tell, this is a opened so i got this i got the small pack so that i can try it i don't talk about a product that i haven't tried yeah maybe it was a guinea pig <laughs> so yeah so okay so something interesting about this product it's not so different from pump pampas the baby dry but i don't want to do a review where i'm comparing that this product with other product i just want to talk about it on its own so this if you use pampas baby dry this is more or less honestly like the same it's a duplicate like it's the same product and okay so, okay the thing uh, the the, the diapers that i've been using before using this was huggies and guys like huggies is heavy it's heavy and thick like it's like can you imagine like putting on like a very very thick pardon like how uncomfortable it is and then putting on a very thin, nice one, Molped. Yeah, so again, something about Molfix. So the company that produces Molfix is the same company that produces Molped. So they have a range of other products. So Molped is a very nice uh, diaper, I mean, sorry, pad line, and I love it, but I'm, I won't talk about it today. So for today, I'll just talk about this one. So yeah, imagine like wearing a very wearing a one. So that's how I imagine like babies feel with diapers, obviously. So yeah, so this, it's thin. It's just as thin, maybe slightly, slightly, slightly thicker than the Pampas Baby Dry. But I just love how thin it is. Like, you can't compare these two Huggies. <laughs> yeah, and then, um, okay, I'm not so big at, like, at appearance. Okay, I used to, but then again, like, functionality number one. Like, I'm not so big at appearance. The only thing I don't like about appearance is this green. <laughs> but, anyway, that's not so important. So... Okay, the reason why I was very, very, very mad at Huggies is, so my baby had, like, it, I I had to get, like, a big size, not even a big, like, just something fitting for her, and it's slightly big, so it's fitting on the waist, but it's slightly big down here, and then now she always had, like, a scar, like, it's like when she sits, and then now the thickness and the thickness, and I don't know what, uh, I don't know if it's the tape over here or what or how the tape connects to this other tape so she had a, a she used to have a red um scar it's like a clot and then a lot like it's it has even nothing to do with the absorption or nothing to do with the comfortability down here it's just everything to do with how it fits that i didn't like so like it's like it, the 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 hug is had us usually has a stretch over here in the middle and then this part doesn't stretch so much Okay, okay, this is just so weird. There's a day I got uh, the Huggies, the big pack, and it was different. It didn't have the stretch here. It had the stretch here. And then when I buy a, a similar, the similar Huggies size from another supermarket, it, it wasn't that one. So I don't know, like, do they produce, like, different? Probably they do produce different, or maybe it was a trial. I really don't understand, but that was be better for me at that time. 
yeah so the thing about this so i love how it stretches yeah just like um pampas it does stretch here so this allows for you to i don't know like for for it to stretch when it's on the baby because the hug is on just so stiff it doesn't stretch the baby is uncomfortable so now what it does so when you hook it up to this side yeah there's enough space here in between like there's enough space for the baby to feel comfortable which honestly i can't say the same about the diaper i was using before so yeah so for me like that was number one i just wanted something that's comfortable for the baby so when i tried this and she's just so comfortable it's nice it's thin she doesn't wake up in the morning and feel like she's added weight because the diaper is so full and bulky and heavy yeah and then this is just so similar to to pampas baby dry as i've said except now for pampas baby dry when when the diaper is it sort of like detaches from this so it sticks like this part sticks on the baby but this doesn't do that it, it just stays compact which i like so i would this over pampas baby dry and then it doesn't have a smell it, it's sort of smells like like very mild aloe vera which honestly i don't even mind so yeah for me like the fit has to be well the absorption like the small things like this shouldn't detach from the rest of the diaper when it's wet you get and then yeah i guess like for me those are the things i look at for i really don't care about all these things indicator and all that we are at the stage where we really don't care about that okay so now i'll talk about the negatives so i saw people saying about how the quality has deteriorated so i wouldn't know how it was before but if it was better than this then wow and then they were saying that uh the for the pants that they tear okay so that's something i realized so i got the pants as well to just compare okay first of all my baby doesn't fit in any pants yeah so for this one like you find like there are small things that are just falling apart so you'll find is okay so usually like you'll find so I'll, uh, i think i'll go i'll try remove like as many as i can to see because there are a few that i did remove and found the the tearing like you'll find like this part here like it's torn something like this okay this i've done it myself so i'll just try remove and see if i can find any if i can then this was a good pack Uh, but yeah so someone was saying about how like half the diapers in the pack were torn so i guess that's just like a production problem and not really like just how the diaper is which they should have recalled anyway okay so okay uh, okay so this pack seems to be good except like i did remove like one or two and one of them was torn and then someone said that it doesn't absorb like it leaks Okay so I've used this and it doesn't leak so I don't understand me I don't know I, I I've done the absorption test and it just absorbs so well so maybe that pack was was a default pack but it doesn't leak I don't know what they mean by leak is it on the sides or what because you can see it has the big wings so it's able to absorb like honestly I don't think I have anything negative to say about this diaper at least for this pack that I got so maybe you'll be unlucky to find a pack that maybe was not well produced or something but for this pack I'm genuinely like I'm so surprised like more fixes are honestly like I'd give it 9 out of 10 the, the reason I I'd take away the one is cuz cuz of the the packaging like if I went into the supermarket like I don't think my eyes would gravitate towards this cuz of the green I'll probably go for like a mint green or a teal or turquoise or just something else not green green you know like yeah so yeah honestly like so this is a part of a diaper so maybe this came off summer so yeah so those are, are really the only things i have to say about morphix i've tried it on my baby it's okay i've i've tried it for about nights three or four nights and she's been fine she hasn't had any diaper rash i've tried it during the daytime it stays well it doesn't fall off okay yeah someone said that it falls off i don't know like does this come off okay i, I mean it's supposed to do that but I don't I don't know what they mean by it. like it falls off or maybe the pants like when it's wet it falls off I don't know. So I haven't experienced that myself. So yeah, for a mom who only knew Huggies and Pampers, I'm very very surprised and I honestly love Morphix. And I would be buying it 
honestly and it's cheaper so it's it's cheaper and it's a good product i don't know if there's like a premium brand like maybe morphix gold or something maybe we could try that and then just see maybe next time what i can do is compare morphix to pampas baby dry because it's more or less the same thing honestly um even like the diaper almost looks exactly the same so yeah thank you so much i hope this review for morphix helps you like make your decision if you're stuck and you don't know if you want to get morphix or not or maybe you think it's cheap and maybe it's not a good product it is like it's it, it doesn't even deserve to be that cheap yeah so thank you so much for watching don't forget to like share and subscribe i'll see you in my next episode bye